Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're delving into one of the most controversial events in modern history, the nuclear attack of America on Japan during World War II. Many have debated the real reasons behind this decision, and in this video, we'll be diving deep into the topic to uncover the truth. So, if you're ready to explore the real motives behind the atomic bombings, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more intriguing historical insights. Let's get started. The bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki in August 1945, which resulted in the deaths of over 100,000 people, were monumental events that changed the course of history. The decision to use atomic bombs on civilian populations has been the subject of intense debate, and various reasons have been put forth to justify this action. While the commonly cited reasons include ending the war quickly, saving American lives, sending a message to the Soviet Union, and testing the power of the atomic bomb, there are other perspectives that question the true motives behind the bombings. In this video, we will explore the real reasons behind the nuclear attack of America on Japan during World War II, examining different arguments and counterarguments to shed light on this controversial topic. One of the most commonly cited reasons for the bombings was the desire to end the war quickly and save American lives. The war in the Pacific had been brutal and costly for the United States, with heavy casualties suffered in battles such as Iwo Jima and Okinawa. The use of the atomic bomb was believed to be a way to force Japan to surrender and avoid a prolonged and costly invasion of the Japanese mainland. Proponents of this view argue that the bombings were a strategic military decision aimed at bringing a swift end to the war. Another reason put forth is the desire to send a message to the Soviet Union, which was emerging as a global superpower and a potential rival to the United States. The bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki were seen as a demonstration of the United States' nuclear prowess and a warning to the Soviet Union about the consequences of challenging American dominance. Some historians argue that the bombings were not only aimed at ending the war with Japan but also at establishing American supremacy in the post-war world order. The desire to test the power of the atomic bomb has also been suggested as a motive for the bombings. The development of the atomic bomb was a top secret and highly expensive endeavor, and the United States may have wanted to demonstrate the devastating capabilities of this new weapon. The bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki provided an opportunity to test the effectiveness of the atomic bomb in a real-world scenario, which could have influenced the decision to use it. Additionally, the bombings have been linked to the desire for revenge for the attack on Pearl Harbor. The surprise attack on the U.S. naval base in Pearl Harbor by Japan in 1941 resulted in the loss of American lives and significant damage to the U.S. Pacific Fleet. The use of the atomic bomb on Japan was seen as a way to avenge the attack on Pearl Harbor and inflict similar devastation on Japan. This emotional response and the need for revenge may have influenced the decision to use such a devastating weapon. However, there are valid counterarguments to these reasons. Some historians argue that Japan was already on the brink of surrender before the atomic bombings, and the use of such destructive weapons was unnecessary. Japan's military and industrial capabilities were severely weakened by that point, and they were considering surrendering to the Allies. The bombings, therefore, raise questions about the true motives behind their use. Furthermore, the long-term consequences of the bombings cannot be ignored. The radiation effects of the bombings led to widespread health issues, including cancer and birth defects, that continue to affect the survivors and their descendants to this day. The environmental damage caused by the bombings also had long-term implications for the affected areas. Critics argue that the use of such destructive weapons with far-reaching consequences raises moral and ethical concerns. If you're finding this information intriguing, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more historical insights. The real reasons behind the nuclear attack of America on Japan during World War II are complex and multifaceted. As historians continue to debate the true reasons behind the bombings, it remains a contentious and controversial topic in history. 
We hope this video provided you with a deeper understanding of this complex and controversial topic. Be sure to stay tuned for more interesting videos on our channel. Until next time, remember to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Thank you for watching.